Hi, I'm Kristen, and we are revisiting Faustow Adventures. Um, when I first uploaded this video, the, um, the game creator found it and was so excited. And I, I know that feeling, because I do game dev too, and I know what it's like to obsessively Google your game twice a day for several weeks. Um, but they told me that, like, the game was done, and it was all done, and it was gonna be, um, uploaded soon, follow it on Game Jolt, and he was so excited, so I think this is the finished version now, uh, and we are gonna play it, still in Portuguese, I've got my Google Translate up, um, off, off screen for you guys, and we're gonna, that's gonna be half the fun. I figured out why, oh, it's, the music stopped, it's gonna start back up. I figured out why... There's so much Final Fantasy and, like, Squaresoft music in this game. Because the only other game on this person's, um, Game Jolt dev page is a Final Fantasy fan game. My last video did not get any copyright hits. So fingers crossed. New game. Okay, enter. Forgot the fucking controls. I'm not even gonna try. Um, the year 2010. Something audiences around the globe? There's something simple to do. Another thing is like, I'm pretty sure based off the last game where we fought a... Soccer player? That, uh, there's gonna be a lot of cultural references that those of us not from the Portuguese speaking world are not going to understand. But that's also half the fun. Oh wow. Can I, uh, can I open my menu? How do I open my menu? Fingers crossed, I'm gonna hit escape. Oh! Um, abilities, equipment, I forgot what this is. Stats! See? No? Check space? Yes. Oh, it freaks me out pre pressing escape. Formation, and that's probably saved. I do not want to go back to the title. Save. Okay, I accidentally exited the game because I thought that that was save. So it was probably we can only save save points. I'm gonna click off and Google Translate. Get out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, so I'm not gonna do that. Don't give me that look. He's such an angry little boy. He keeps giving me this angry look until I pull out the camera. Sorry, my cat's like opening my door. Kept giving me this angry look until I tried to take a picture. So, something... He... Has to get to his friends faster. I'm gonna say that's what's going on. This dungeon is east of center. I'm gonna, I'm just gonna look up those last couple words and, uh... Midwest. Oh. The Dungeon of the Midwest. Okay. Well, let's go into this castle town, which I believe was the only thing we could go into originally. Oh my goodness. Let's talk to Sleepy. I'm gonna be completely inept at this game. Now that it has dialogue, I'm gonna have no fucking clue what to do, but we're gonna, we're gonna do what we can. Oh, he rolled over. Oh! 
Am I flipping him over to try to wake him up? No? No? Ooh, do I want to something? Oh, do I want to buy some armor, I bet. Some armor! Yes. Hmm. So we already know Sarah means exit. Totally portraying these words, by the way, probably. Okay. And I don't even have any fucking money. But look at all these things we could get. Yeah. Let's exit this for now. Uh, I'm gonna just start... I think I found a page down button. Page up. I'm gonna start pressing buttons until I find an exit that's not the escape key because that makes me very fucking nervous, but there we go. Which is probably why all the shopkeepers are standing outside. That's not the right button. Do I want to buy weapons? I, I'm, I'm broke, man. Wh whatever you say, bro. Like, I know that this is not Pokemon, but I just feel like I want to go around this guy and not walk in front of him because he's going to fight me. Hello. That's the menu again. God damn it. I think he's saying it's a nice day, isn't it? Every couple years, I'll try to teach myself French. With like... A very old copy of Rosetta Stone. So I can kind of recognize the roots of a lot of the words. I have no idea what she's saying? Do I want to... something. Kampar might have the same route as camp, so she might be asking if I want to rest at the inn. Do I want to buy something? Um... I think this means an item shop? Let's just find out. Yep. Still probably can't go in it. That's still a fucking menu. I keep pressing the wrong button. Okay. Okay, so I have a choice between the Goiba or the Onibus. Do I want... Oh. Haha, <laughs> not Guava. Guava. For some reason, that word means Guava, whether it has the first A or not. Now let's see if I can get the other word without the accent mark, because I don't know how to do that with my keyboard. Do I want the guava or the bus, guys? Do I want the guava or the bus? I can't fucking afford either. Yeah, do I... Uh, uh, fuck it. Give me the bus, little girl. She probably just turned me down because I don't have any fucking money. Hello, friend. Um, I can get a lemonade for ten dollars. Um, and I took some sort of issue with that. But yeah, if I can get a whole fucking guava for one, if I can buy a bus for one dollar. I am not paying $10 for a lemonade. I don't know this music. Let's talk to this lady. She has a dragon. <sighs> Special something. Special place. 
there's a special place. There's probably so many clues I'm missing right now. I didn't expect... I expected something along the lines of Roar, but that dragon fucking said something to me and I don't fucking know what it is. <sighs> okay, I'm not gonna do the talk to everybody thing because I don't fucking know what they're saying. So I'm gonna just kind of barge into what seems to be important areas. Well, that area is very closed off, and there are a lot of people. It looks like a classroom. It's very closed off. Oh, hello! A mana potion! There might be something in the shelves. Sometimes there's shit in the shelves. I want to get into this fucking, like, boxing class or something, but they just shoved pillars in the way of the entrances. Which probably just means not yet. There must be something else. Hello? No. Sometimes in rooms like that, in some games, it's like, you can, you can rest here for free because we're in the castle. Still don't know what this music's from. Let's see if there's some side entrances to those other areas. find something. This place is a little funky. There's metal bars on the door. Oh. Hello. Them sprites, though. Those trees, though! Oh, man! Sexy. That's actually a pretty nice trick for that, though. For the... You can pass behind the top of the tree and stuff. I never fucking thought of that. And that is actually kind of fucking brilliant. Something I'm gonna have to remember. Look, I can step off the ledge! Oh, fuck. But yeah, it's something I'm gonna have to remember. I am content to explore the other side of this, even though I know I won't find anything new. Because of this fucking music, yeah. Can I exit this way? Nope. Ah, uh, y'all! You gotta, you gotta let me exit when I walk just off the map. <laughs> no. I know this music. And I'm really fucking bothered by the fact that I can't... No, 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 this is, this is from Chrono Trigger. Whoa, what is this? I get to save? Yay, so now I know what save points look like. There's another iron bar over the castle. I don't think I'm gonna be able to do anything until I figure out what's going on in the main town. There's the northeastern dungeon. 
I don't think I'm gonna be allowed to enter anything until I figure out what the fuck I'm supposed to do in that main town. The dungeon north. Something is dripping outside. Oh, this is this is fucking the probably the final place. I wanna fight something. Okay, so I went fucking everywhere. And I'm stuck. So I'm gonna have to do a lot of Google translating and jump cuts. What a waste of life! What the fuck? Oh, was she talking to me? Don't fill up, okay? Mm, okay. He's probably just calling the food cheap. And my man! If, if you say so. Just hope somebody gives me some useful information. Miss my, comma, you broke my egg. You know, I would be like, don't ever let me play games that aren't in English again. But I'm about to get this machine to let me play some of my old Game Boy games. And one of the selling points is I can get, I can put an SD card in it to translate games that were never released in English and get that amazing machine mistranslation fuckery, which I am so looking forward to, which is kind of what I'm doing the hard way right now. So let's see what this lady's gonna say! There, in that fireplace, has a door that leads to a special place. Yeah, see? She just gave me a fucking clue. I knew she was giving me a fucking clue earlier. I should've... I should've translated her whole sentence. I wanna see what the fuck the dragon's saying to me. Opa and men. I thought that can't have translated correctly. I cannot. Okay. Can I just, like, take a shortcut now? Can I just skip? Whatever's going on here, and look for a fireplace? Help! I didn't walk up to that door because I didn't expect it to open! And this is, this is where I started out last time. Except, it, I feel like it's gotten a little bit of an upgrade. I still can't play this fucking music. I know it's from Final Fantasy VI and I don't know from what dungeon and it's pissing me off. Because I should know that game backwards and forwards. I have known that game my whole fucking life since before I could read and I can't play this music. Still. And it really fucking bugs me. How am I supposed to be able to read that? Like. A big thing was big. A big basal was found. I should probably um equipment. Yes, best. Well, he already has some equipment. If I find some money, I'm gonna leave and go buy the bus from the little girl. I should probably translate all of what she's saying before I do that. But I kind of just want to be like, yeah, girl, give me a bus. And see what shenanigans ensue. Okay, hello English! Elixir was found! Right, 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 it's... You know, I don't know what the equivalent word for Spanglish is. 
when you're talking about Portuguese and English, but it's it's that. Because the dev kit is made for English. The RPG maker, I'm assuming, is what this was. Or it's, you know, some... No, I'm not ready for that. I'm not ready. No, no, thank you. Not yet. I just want to fight some... There was only, like, one fight the whole game last time, though, so... Magic. I think that's a potion. Oh, look at this! Ba, 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 ba. Yeah, so I'm finding big potion, magic potion. I hope there's nothing like bad at the end. Oh, oh, I can just walk over this shit. Wait. Did I just find a secret glitchy spot? I think I just found a secret glitchy spot and I think I need to find my way to glitch out of it. I don't remember how I entered it, okay? <laughs> that was scary! Like, might get stuck and have to end things scary. Elixir! Are you kidding me? Oh, okay. That's actually kind of cool. Okay, before I go into the big door, I'm gonna exit town completely and go to a far corner of the world map where I know how to save. That's, that's not where I need to be. I want to know why I can't even go into that dungeon. Like, I want to fight something. I want to go into a dungeon. <sighs> is this a person? Yes, yes it is. Oh uh, yeah, I don't, I don't care. He said three words. So there's, there can't be much important in there. Now let's go into that big door, if I can remember how to find it. I don't know if I remember to- oh! That's a goddamn save point. I just fucking went to the far reaches of the goddamn earth for a save point. And if I just walked forward two steps, I would've seen it. Probably means our first fight's coming up. Hopefully it's not a ridiculously hard fight that's not supposed to be our first fight. Cause that happened to me when I when I um first played something made with this dev kit, this asset pack or whatever whatever this was made with. It, 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 I, I had a horribly broken game that, like, it wasn't horribly broken, but, like, I could do the fights so totally out of order, and the storyline was out of order, and it was amazing. He has wings! Hey, hey, Fausto! That much I can fucking put together. Now let's see what he's saying. I was about to say this and then I got distracted. Um, I don't know if I said this already, but I got a new, um, sorry, typing and talking. It's not even in the fucking same language. I got a new microphone. So we meet again is what he's saying. So hopefully I will finally start sounding okay on a regular basis. My old mic, the one in my head, man, that's not headphones. These are headphones. My old mic, the one in my fucking webcam. I don't know why I can't fucking communicate today. Um. Son of a bitch. I forgot to put on lipstick. I'm sorry. I'm a fucking mess today. I don't know what's wrong with me. Um. The old microphone in my webcam. You know, our, at our old place at the apartment, it was fucking fine. 
And then here, half the time it's fucking fine, half the time it sounds like I'm recording in a goddamn stairwell. So I got a microphone when I got our security deposit back. So hopefully I won't sound like shit in half my videos randomly anymore. But we'll see! Time will tell! Anyway, hey hey, Fausto, we meet again! That's not the right button. Oh, that's because I'm still in Google Translate. I'm gonna say that first line says prepare for the battle. Let's see what the fuck the second line says. I will not have pity this time. Is this... Final Fantasy Seven. It's Rodrigo Faro! Still not sure who he is. He might not be a soccer guy, he's holding a microphone. Fight. Attack him. Hit him. I did a lot of damage to him, and he did not do a lot of damage to me if I read that right. So I'm just gonna keep hitting him. Did he hit me twice? This is one of the songs that's in every fucking game, every fucking Final Fantasy. I'm definitely gonna get copyright for this, but that's fine. Oh uh, no! How did this happen? It's starting to autofill. It's starting to realize like what word I'm trying to say. Mm. Why? There's not gonna be any hints in this. Why? A voice from either above or behind. Sandcastle key. I know what that means. Sandcastle key! Dance kitty dance! <laughs> this cannot be translating right, or they're like colloquialisms that don't translate correctly. Like apparently in French, like you call a bad movie a radish, and that doesn't make any fucking sense in English. So it's either it's something like that, but fucking. Sandcastle key! Dance, kitty, dance! Oh, my cat looks so pissed. <laughs> I'm mean, it wasn't talking to you. <laughs> Still that voice from above or behind. I'm not gonna look it up. Center West dungeon key. I know where that is. It looks like Goodbye, here's my outro. Here's my video outro, but let's see what he's actually saying. Bye, see you later. Okay, after a while, crocodile. He had a fucking, he had fucking coffins. Like, I'm sure this would be fucking hilarious if I knew who he was, but, um, yeah. Let's see if I have, do I have money? Yes, I have money, we're gonna go buy a bus. I'm not gonna translate that because it's funnier if I don't. What is there this pothole that just keeps me from walking right down out of the thing? Also, how do I get up there to get that? Oh, I think I might know how to get that treasure chest, but you know what? I don't care, it's probably just gonna be a potion. Time to go to the sand cancel. Cancel? The fucking sand cancel? I 
<laughs> I am having a lot of fun. But most of you have probably stopped watching by now because I feel like I'm being really fucking irritating. We're gonna go to the sand cancel and dance kitty dance. <laughs> After we buy a bus from the little girl with pigtails. I feel like I'm not saying what I think I'm saying. Okay, fuck it, I'm gonna translate her because I wanna know what this is. Or you know what, no, fuck it, I'm just gonna choose guava this time. Oh well, I tried. No guava, no bus. Onto the sand castle. Hey! Woo! That is not the version of that song I thought it was gonna be. Banditos approach you. Okay, they're they're pretty weak. I'm very overpowered for some reason. I got a lot of medium potions. I reached level four. I'm only level four and I'm like one hitting everything. Ooh! Look at those hap I'm not sure what's their. F it looks like they got smiley faces and necklaces, but I know it's like a lot of eyes and then the mandibles. And I know that's just the art that comes with this dev kit slash. Um. I fucking forgot the other word I used that this might be earlier. Asset pack. Swear to god, I'm fucking- I'm sober, I got enough sleep, I- Have I eaten? I haven't eaten. But it's hours till my bedtime, so- Just very often. Oh, I love that pose! It's so dynamic! Dancing skeletons attack me. I just get to see all the pretty art that comes with this dev kit. how easily I'm gaining experience. Big potion! Oh my gosh! They're so pretty! Okay. Okay, real talk. Because I know you're gonna watch this. You might want to take another pass at balancing and patch this because the fights are too easy and too often. And that combination, so often and no challenge, makes them not engaging. Um, 
I'm earning too much experience. I I went I gained four levels without even going through any doorways or experiencing a scene change, and now you're giving me all the money! Like it's it's very convenient, but that means that there is no difficulty curve. There's no challenge, and challenge is what keeps players engaged. Like I usually try to be supportive, especially when I know the the developer has an eye on me, but like one developer to another. Um this game is fun. But the fights really aren't engaging. I haven't had to heal once. I have not felt the need to go back to the save point at all since actually experiencing a battle. I just kind of use them when they're there because of a lifetime's habit. But this game is really fun and you're doing yourself a disservice by making it so easy. I think I just gained level 10, is that correct? Yeah, I, I just gained level 10. That's- I don't need- I don't need that. I don't need any of my items, that's the thing. I don't even need to, uh, I don't even feel the need to update my equipment. Hello! Oh my goodness, did you hear me talking so much? And you know nobody else is here, so I must be talking to you? Is that how it is? He's been very needy. He's always needy. But even his brother's been needy lately. I have some needy boys! Wow, mithril armor. Okay, you know what? Myth like, that is my microphone. Can you not sniff into it so much? I don't know if it's gonna pick that up or not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Oh my god! You're not allowed on top of my fucking computer anymore. I am gonna upgrade the equipment just because having that kind of high level equipment right before a door that I have been taught is most likely gonna lead to a boss fight. I don't take chances. I'm not gonna take a chance. I'm not gonna get lazy. Yet. I'm level 11! Have I been... I think I've been regening health every time I level up, too. That's why I haven't needed to heal. Oh, it's not immediately a boss fight. That's good. That's good. Oh, is this not- does this not work, or did it get glitched out because of the fight? I'll just keep going. Up. Oh, look at how cute they are! I wonder if that's healing water or just a dead end. If I get a dialogue when I walk up to it, that's healing water. Probably, maybe. No dialogue, just a dead end. Ah! I don't trust you. Antidote. I think I just stepped on a little rocky bit of water. Which is something I should keep in mind in case it was on purpose. That might be like an important path clue later. Which way? Not that way. Oh, I'm gonna go b past the big dragon skeleton. Let's see what's left up here! Treasure, but not the next room. Yeah, I really thought that skeleton meant something exciting was gonna happen. Oh my god. Oh, there's- there's the next place.
Okay, I found potion and antidote. And now here's the next, the next room. Frequent save points too, which is not necessarily a bad thing. It's a nice medium for if you want people to be able to save relatively freely, but still want to use save points for whatever reason. Hello! Who is this? Olavo Hamper. Okay. Let's hit him. I did a lot. I don't know what that- did I block his attack? I don't know what that said. I have a status effect. It looks like I'm being evasive, but he cast it on me, so I doubt that's what it is. I just muted my fucking- Give me a second, guys. Okay. Sorry about that. I swear, I turned the ringer off like two minutes before and it's still buzzed. I hate my phone sometimes. It's not as bad though. The phone I used to have, would it would straight up turn its volume back up to max randomly. Anyway, we're gonna hit Olivo again. And he just threw some water at me? But I kicked his ass because I'm super OP. And I got a lot of money. I have more fucking money than I know what to do with because it's not like I need new equipment. And I think I've been learning a lot of- wait. Add... I'm either ga getting a lot of equipment or I'm learning a lot of abilities. Okay, now let's see what weird shit he says. Oh, I won an ability called... Something time. Time something. It didn't translate correctly. I think that second word might be some sort of combo word that you get sometimes with, you know, when you're naming shit. He didn't say anything. I don't know who that guy is. I don't know if it makes sense that he didn't talk or not. We're gonna walk into this thing. And it took us back to the entrance of the dungeon! I don't know what I'm supposed to do now! I guess I used my time ability? Dance Kitty Dance is an ability I have? And I got some elemental magic and a cure. Not that I've ever needed it. Um, now what? Let's go talk to the hint lady and see if she says anything new. I've been recording for like an hour, but I'm still really into this game. So she says the same fucking thing. So it's time to start talking to other- Still can't get in there! Start talking to other people! Which I guess means these guys. See, these are not full sentences, so I don't think they're telling me anything important. Okay, she might be saying something important. I always wanted to know what's behind that door. My daddy is very dangerous. Did I miss a word? No? Okay. Oh. I, I didn't- I did mistype something. I always wanted to know what's behind that door, but my dad is very dangerous. 
probably dad says it's very dangerous. She doesn't say a lot, so I don't think it's important. She didn't say a lot either. I'm gonna see if I can fi find any new hints in this castle, and if not, I'm gonna call it. Cause I've been doing this for a while. I did a dead end. So, I'm gonna call it. I've been recording for an hour. Uh... Yeah, I've been recording for an hour, which is a lot longer than I usually record a game. I got really into to play like a lot of it and say fuck it this video is gonna be just hella long but uh yeah i've reached I've, I've reached a wall i am out of ideas i don't know what to do i mean i guess we could go in the boat but i don't think it's gonna fuck it let's go in the boat let's go in the boat let's go in the boat and go to that little island up in the north not northwest, the northwest, and see what happens. Nothing's gonna happen, but let's see what happens. And then I'll end my video. Yeah! What? Can I enter that? Ah! Um, uh, that's not what's supposed to happen. I don't like that. <laughs> that scared me. I didn't like that. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my god, there's a whole ice area up there! I don't wanna go here. Oh, no, that's nothing? Wait, if I actually go to the dock, can I go in there? Nope! Well, let's see what's in the ice area. Let's just fucking explore the map. Why not? Why not? Another blocked castle town? I mean, okay, wait, 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 wait. There might be... I might have freed up. That, uh, but, but, but. That's where I was. Oh. That's why it said South Dungeon even though I went north. It's possible that I freed up the town. I might have taken a gate off somewhere. So actually, let's see what's in this desert town. That's not a town. Let's see if anything's changed up here. I think there was a gate up here. By the safe egg. Maybe. There was! Oh! 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 I'm not out of ideas! Ah! Okay. One ridiculously long video coming up. Because I'm having fun, so fuck it. Elixir! Let's go down this narrow hallway. Oh! I didn't expect to actually be rewarded for going down the narrow hallway. Big potion! I'm just gonna keep going. Uh, oh. Okay. No, that is a wall. Okay. Oh, maybe I should, um... Try to figure out how to speak to that man. Which means I should probably not be dicking around on the very periphery of the castle. Oh! This- this might help. Yay! Uh, I'm gonna assume these are teleport pads? Hey! Medium potion was found. Let's see if this is yet another type of teleport pad. Hey, it's a puzzle! I'm, I just, I don't care what's in the chest. I've got so many potions. Hmm. I feel so accomplished for remembering that this place existed. Elixir.
after this dungeon I'll do outro and then make another video. It's all gonna be one sitting, but after this dungeon I'll make another video. Hello. He looks happy. Looks a little bit like Mario. Ha 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 ha, look who just turned up. Welcome to my castle, Fausto. What do you think? Oh my. <laughs> no matter what I found, I came here to break up with you. My goodness. This man's just trying to win my love with his fancy magical teleportation like sandy tile castle and I'm just here to break his heart. Okay, let's go to the fight! Yes! Chrono Cross! I fucking love the battle system in Chrono Cross. Like, one of my big things about the way RPGs evolve is that, like, the genre was just starting to, or at least this shit that was released in America, maybe it was more fleshed out in Japan, but the genre was just starting to really explore different types of turn-based um, RPG combat, uh, like turn-based, menu-based RPG combat. They were just starting to get, like, kind of innovative and interesting with it, and then suddenly it was like, everything's action and button mash and move around a tiny map. But I really like the battle system in Chrono Cross, and that's not what this video is about, so let's beat the shit out of this, out of this dude. Out of Gilberto Barros Oleo. I'm, I'm gonna see what that... if that means something. The lion! Well, let's let's get the crap out of Gilbert the lion. And I, I... I know what that one means. I'm blind. So, I'm gonna use some magic! Let's freeze the lion. That does less than my attack. I'm still doing actually quite a bit of physical damage. Poor lion. Aww. Huh. It seems like you beat me, old friend. Aww. Let's see what he says. Because I see something about a metal castle, so this might actually be important dialogue. You're worthy of going to the next level. Take it! That pegway, the capitalized word, it seems to have been translated as take it! The castle of the metal castle of the Sudest. Did I not type that? I did not type that right. Of the Southeast. The castle of the metal castle of the Southeast. The voice, the voice from somewhere says, Metal Castle Key. Casino! Wrong window. Northeast Dungeon Key. I gotta use these abilities. I can I not, oh, this is probably the shortcut back. Yeah. Um, I gotta use these abilities and see what the fuck they even look like. I wanna see what Dance Kitty Dance fucking looks like. But that's gonna be in the next video. So, I've been Kristen. This has been my revisitation of Faust Adventures. I'm having fun. Like, I'm genuinely engaged in this. Even though at this point I'm kind of ignoring combat. I am genuinely engaged in figuring out what the hell is going on in this game. So, I'm gonna do a part two. And... 
yeah, I'm gonna do a part two. Uh, link to this game is gonna be in the description. If you enjoyed this, please like, subscribe, or leave a comment. Thanks. Bye bye